Well then, here we go then. With the Ace Attorney. Bum, 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 bum. Alright then. Let's uh, continue then. Oh, why does this feel loud? I don't know, maybe that's just me. It's literally early morning, so. Well, no, it's actually like 12 pm now, but. There we go. Nice. Let's continue the shit then, yeah? So, second case done. The whole thing defeated Francesco, whatever the name is, uh, Silverhair, Von Karma, and uh, also proved that Maya is not a killer once again. Basically, clearing her up once again, saving her and all that, and uh, yeah. Now we're here. But the third case, which seems like it leads into. Um, it, it, well, we, if she comes back again, I don't think she'll be gone. Like, she might be here for the whole like rest of this game, just the game, maybe not the series, but you know. Shit, let's see though. So this is called episode three. Ep uh, uh, turn about big top. Yeah. Let's see what this episode is. There was a little preview. We saw some clown shit, but let's see what is actually giving attention to it. Welcome to the show. Prepare to witness a man. Who has mastered the wonder of light? Yeah, we uh, we kind of uh, saw a little bit of this, but I, I wasn't trying to pay attention. Oh, who the fuck is this guy? Is the world's greatest magician, the one beyond these Maximilian Galactica? Huh? He's flying. Ah, oh, shit. Yo, he's flying. No way. And he wrapped himself up and disappeared? What? Possible. <laughs> Amazing. How could he do it? And obviously this is going to be doing to do with this fucking circus bullshit. Oh, and it is a circus, yep. December 26th. Oh, look at that. Reaching the end of the year once again. Time is really skipping. 8 p.m. Very big circus. Circus entrance. <laughs> Oh, no, why do you make that face? I hear it. No, oh, that was like being in a dream. Could this music be any louder? I hear when she does that look, bro. Why do you do that? I hear it. I mean, you caught my breath yet. Yeah, can you just remove your hands? Oh, you. And why do you give me the angriest eyebrows on earth? Like, the fuck? That was amazing, wasn't it, Polly? Like, you're saying that with such an angry look. <laughs> Are you happy or not? <laughs> It was great, there was a dancing bear and a tiger that jumped through a ring of fire and opened a little giant ball, not to mention the guy who pulled through the air. Yeah, Max Galactica, he was absolutely fabulous. Ah, oh, what? Max? Max Galactica, the world's best magician. A magician? No, a magician. Listen to What is it? What is it, Pauls? Does magic eventually do a charming spirits? I don't think I have anything to do with channeling. You don't know about magic, do you? Stop doing that. Bro, why they give her that as one of the stop fucking, like, PNG reactions, bro? I know, I don't like it. It's like, why do you do that? Like, that's the sort of shit you were doing when it was like, oh, you two leave you together sort of shit, like, acting like me and fucking Maya or thing or some shit. It's like, why do you do that regularly? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'd like it if it wasn't the same fucking PNG over and over. Stock PNG number two, pretty much. I braved the winter cold and took pills to see the circus. It's been six months since that terrible incident in Quarain village. Oh yeah, and her, she didn't have a fucking mother tying her down so she can actually experience what the fuck the world is. And it was during that time that I met pills. Yeah. I don't like this music though. Thankfully she seems to recover, be recovering from it and has returned to her normal self. Oh, it's time to go. Okay. Are you alright? We can't miss the last train. You remember the train? Of course I did, but I don't really understand what Express Evan means by Express Train. Well, Nick, see you later. I'll come by to help clean the office. That's where I'll be spotless for the new year. Don't worry about it, really. <laughs> you are going to visit Mr. Nick on New Year's. Maybe. <laughs> I'm glad you will get to spend your New Year's with your special someone. See, it makes sense to use that there, but it's like, I hate seeing that every time. It's like, once or twice, but not every fucking time. 
Harley, look, it's time to go. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, me and her are not a thing, bro. She is, she is nah, definitely not her. Francesca, though? Yo, she is definitely uh, an option. Happy New Year. Uh, yep, Happy New Year. I guess. <laughs> I really hope it will turn out that way. Yeah, maybe it'll turn out to be a sad fucking end of the year. A death. A trial. 9.12 a.m. Well, this is... Well, today we're going to have to put this here. Oh, we're going to finish cleaning this place in one day. <laughs> no. Hello? This is the right call. Nick, it's terrible. What the fuck already? Oh, my perfect timing. Things sure are terrible here too. Huh? The office is terrible mess. I have to clean it up. What are you talking about? Huh? My dirty office. What are you talking about? Listen, Nick, you have to turn on the TV. Oh, God, here we go. Well, I hope we're ready for another murder action. Welcome. Thank you, we're here at the Big Berry Circus. The Big Berry Circus has become the center of sensational murder. The scene has created quite a stir among the throngs of excited onlookers. The very, I mean, the very big circus? That's the circus we went to, right? They're saying that there was a murder. Oh, wrong voice. Oh, yeah. I, I, I'm not trying to assign voices, but shit, I couldn't tell. Yeah, they arrested him too. Arrested who? Max. They arrested Max Galactica. The fucking magic guy. This girl guy. Oh, no. It. A popular magician who can fly through the sky at will. Apparently. I said she was a huge fan of Max. Uh huh. Yeah, the the topless rose, like the the pink. Po yeah, I can see it. Okay. I don't know people are far. All right, Nick. I'll see you in two hours at the detention center. Ah, huh? what? See you there. You've got still got plenty of time to clean up your office later. What? <laughs> what? You Man, I guess the office is going to be in shambles after the case. 11.19am. Alright, well, 20. What are, you, what are they talking about? Why did they arrest Max? You're asking the wrong man on that one, Maya. Maybe he uses magical skills to deal death with a sleight of hand. <laughs> he would never do such a thing. Oh god, I'm not sure. What the young lady just said was absolutely fabulous. <laughs> well, clever girl. Such a fabulous understanding of events. Okay. I don't know if I'm gonna like this guy. What's with all this fabulous talk? <laughs> what the fuck? Welcome to the visitor's room. <laughs> yeah, thanks. I can see that. It's Max and it look, it's the real uh, yeah. Alright, so you pick a card. Any card. Classic line. He called me up. Swoon <laughs> Just swoon. My god. Yeah. yeah, just get the fucking card already, my uh, This one. I thought you would pick that one. I'm not saying those words. There is some parts. Okay, stop. Uh, it's, 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 oh god. Somebody take her away. Uh, you saw the one. Oh my god. He's fucking flying with somebody in a jail cell right now. Stop! Stop! No! Swoon. <laughs> Stop. No, I don't wanna... I don't want that. You must be... Driver. A driver? Ah, uh, I want this one. Let's be honest here. You came to this visitor's room to visit me, didn't you? Yeah, I'm your biggest fan. Yeah. Uh, what about my card? I think of it as a souvenir. Oh. Well, Nick, I think it's time to get to work. What's the matter, Nick? Why are you looking at the ceiling? I was just thinking about how oh, well, I should pop lunch. Drop porcupine head over there. Show me with your attention. Okay. Uh, <sighs> fucking these girls, man. Oh, God. Absolutely cringe-inducing. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. Yeah. Well, I was hoping you could tell me a little bit more about yourself. Stop it. Stop that bullshit, bro. Oh. Stop. Uh, 
to fucking use it, man. What is this guy talking about? Uh, uh, people nowadays, I get the twenties all in a bunch of nothing. Anyway, you, well, you won a very prestigious award recently, did you know? Uh, and then... Uh, won the Magician's Grand Prix Held Association of International Magician. It's well that I can the... Uh, I'm not saying that shit, man. I'm not... I'm sick of this dialogue already. Oh, the trophy and the burst, it was... I mean, it was an amazing day. Okay. Certifiably the great... Yeah, sure. I'm glad to ask you didn't win a trophy for the most modest magician. Alright, what about the circus? Excellent to catch up with the circus. Uh, long and short of it, you did your research. Nice. Uh, you can't just watch them on TV, you know? You have to see with your own eyes. Magic that is. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Uh, the circus is a dinosaur, you know, old as fuck. Uh, no one cares about what goes on there. Why do you mean? What do you mean? That's why I signed the contract. You signed the contract. The circus is not popular, never popular with me. Uh, they just want to see me, you know, cut it to me. I revived this little fucking dinosaur of the circus. Yeah, it's just, you know, my magic as usual, yeah. And she's so happy, you think, yeah, yeah. Made all the circus, I made all the shitty performances prior all obsolete. But I like performances though. <laughs> Well, Maya, this is what you get for liking a fucking buzzer like this, man. This is what you like. Someone who's... Uh, who, someone who, you know, laying his charm on you, and now you're feel, feeling sad about one thing. You know, this is what you deserve, though. <laughs> Tell me about the, what happened, you know? Last night, uh, Ringmaster was murdered. The Russell Berry... Smashed him over the head. Uh, and then he summed over on the ground. It's the middle of the night, police present was uh, the police were there. The police questioned me at length. What do you mean, questioned you? Everything. Uh, I was the last one to see him though before he died. I saw him last evening in his room. And then you were arrested. Don't... Okay. They just wanted to consult him with me, I pause. Definitely not arrested. I don't think he understands how serious this is. Yeah, I don't think he does. So, you met with the roommates before the murder. What do you talk about? Are you not your business? Why are you asking? What do you talk about? Nothing, small talk. Salary chart. I'm the one bringing the crowds. I thought, you know, I need to get compensated as much. Yeah, I guess. That's what you talked about? Of course. Oh! The jailhouse lock. <laughs> <laughs> ah, he's, he's got me saying it. <laughs> That's why I'm avoiding saying it, Felix. I'm not saying it because I don't want to say it. What's the matter? You see my burn out of shape? Uh, it's because, well... It's time! Uh, you want some hidden truths? You're lying, of course. One day we're gonna have our defense, the person we're defending be convicted of a, a crime and it's actually gonna become the truth. I wanna see that for once though, you know? Maybe this will be it. Last night you met with the ringmaster, right? Negotiating your salary and such? Yeah? Agreement over my six month old contract. That's the truth, the whole? What do you mean? So you just went to negotiate about your new salary at his office? I hate liars, says you. I don't think I've enough evidence here, I should not see it and gather. They forced me, I mean, my whole purpose was to go and do that though. They won't let me go there though. Using a disappearing up. I'm an attorney. An attorney? Then why are you talking to me? Yeah, listen, it's fine, y'all. Okay, relax. 
They are just over I'm just looking. <laughs> Anyways, I've been curious for a while now. What? Why do you keep looking at me with sad look on your face? <laughs> because you've been arrested. Don't be ignorant as if they'd arrest me. Why is that? Because I'm him. <laughs> I'm not saying the whole lines. I'm sorry, I gave up with this fucking guy. I'm the star of the circus. That means I'm rich. Which means... Quit joking, you got quit joking around, you got to be pulling... Oh no, I'm... They are, the police are actually serious though, are they? They don't arrest for a joke, you know. Look at him crushed. Well, he need to wake up and smell the coffee. Uh, yeah? I mean, so, you're a lawyer, right? Uh, yeah, I'm on turn. <laughs> he changed up so fast. Help me, I didn't kill nobody. He changed up so fast. His fucking eyes are leaking, squidding. Oh, oh fuck that. I didn't kill nobody. I may be spoiled. But a killer? That's insane. Couldn't do it ever. I swear. I just want to pay off my dad's debt. Yeah, I'll take your case, fuck me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, thanks for- yeah, 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 okay. What's your real name? Billy Bob- <laughs> Billy Bob <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> He's dead. What's the matter? He's really just a country bumpkin. Says you. <laughs> Says you. The fuck? Huh? Mr. Attorney, a few minutes ago you took one of my cars, didn't you? No, they not. Yeah, I did take one. Ten of hearts, right? How do you know? What can I say? You stolen some of my most valuable possessions. Ten! I'm just... You should have, you should have a lot of hearts, don't you? <laughs> I'm putting my faith in you. You know, just call me. I, I, I hope not. Alright, let's make this, uh... The, 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 Can we go now? You need to go to the circus. There we go. Alright, let's do this then. Fuck me, man. I, I, uh... It'll be a while till we talk with him. We're here again. Yep, but this one we're here for work. It's been that long since the crime, so the police are still in the case. Uh, see you know what I mean. Oh, we're probably gonna see uh, the big T sister, aren't we? Because I'm pretty sure she's gonna transform into it, or the fucking kids are going to transform into it and you know what i can bet you on that much well no i hope she i hope they don't keep bringing back mia constantly i mean yeah she's nice and all but fuck i don't give a fuck at this point anymore it's like yo you need to stay dead and just go away let me fucking do my cases unless i'm desperate then help me <laughs> let's find someone who might know something about what happened sounds like a plan mm -hmm. uh my ears no stop it Circus said show sure doesn't look this small from uh, in the audience seats. This is where they all perform, isn't it? Do do some somersaults. What? I'm not doing anything like that. Why not? You look like you'd be great. Why oh, do I look like I'd be great at somersaults? <laughs> huh? No, it wasn't me. Oh hell no. <laughs> Tiger. He's coming this way. Oh shit. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you for real? <laughs> Nick, you're too young to die. Stay, stay, heal. Are you for real? Did I actually get attacked by a real one? Still here, I'm not dead yet. <laughs> Nick, are you okay? <laughs> you scared you, didn't I? The fuck are you? Rajan is such a cute... No? What's the matter? You two sure are quiet. Still, what's the matter me? He almost died there. He wasn't anywhere close to getting hurt, let alone dying. This little tiger hardly ever bites people. Besides, people don't really never get to play with a wild tiger, right? If you think about it, actually, real lucky. Huh? You agree? Uh, I guess. What do you mean, you guess? Why are you agree with that? 
your costume. Huh? That's cute, I wanna try it on. Look this costume, I mean my clothes. You mean my clothes? Uh, you don't mind letting me try it on, right? Uh, I guess not. Really? You're the best? Well, the tables turn so quickly. So much for the tiger thing. Oh, I forgot to introduce this. I'm Regina Burry. Animal Tamer. Okay. My name's my favorite spirit medium. Phoenix Rider, Tony Allah. When you close next to an animal tamer, I bet we do look hot. <laughs> nice to meet you. Oh, okay. Is this... The music is too much for me, man. Seriously. Hey, wh what do you know about what happened last night? I'm turning this music down. I've had enough. You mean the murder? Yeah, no shit, the murder. How do I turn the music down? Right, it's already... It. So it's gonna be real quiet, but that's alright, alright. There's a 40% outside 10. You mean the murder? Yeah, the murder. My dad was my... Oh, your dad. Oh, is it... Oh, what did she just say? Oh, the ringmaster was your... Okay, I can turn it back up. Yep, the ring muscles on my dad. Why well, she's the murderer? I'm sorry about what happened. But why do you say you're sorry? Oh, the music's back, huh? Anyways, everyone was here practicing last night, even when your dad? Yeah, everyone was here. We finished up around 10 pm. But that everyone went off on their own. I was the only one who stayed around here. Why did you do that? I was playing with a giant. And the tiger. That's when the police showed up, when they took me to check things out, our dad was dead. For someone whose father was just murdered, she seems awfully perky. Yeah, it's too fucking weird. But she would tell them more about her dad. I and, uh, that's incredible that you're an animal tamer, if you say so. What the fuck? It has to be really scary. Scary, why? Huh? The gen isn't scary, it's cute. Ever since Leon died, <laughs> Red has been my best friend. Leon? Leon the Lion. Leon the Lion would sound easy, but it has a weird, you know. Leon the Lion, Regen uh, Regina. Yeah, nine choice indeed. He died? Yeah, actually, he was killed. My dad killed him. What the fuck is this case? Why did you do that? I'm not sure. It's tough not to get charmed when she talk looks at you with some eyes. Um... Uh, He's right, we can fit 500. 500? Alright, use this in four. 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 Use this info. Use this info. Alright, well, let's move out of here. Fuck me, man. It's so annoyingly loud. I had to turn it down, man. I'm sorry, but they had to. The music got so unbearable. I can turn it back up, though. This seems to be a down where all the performers in the circus do, really? So we might run into that studio clown here, right? Ah, it's you two. No, Gummy! Oh, you guys always seem to know when I'm working a crime scene. Because you're always working, Detective. Well, I'd rather not be working. I'm always working, but with crime, you don't make your, your own hours. If I have to be at the circus anyway, I want to see the lion team and the tightrope. I don't know my work, but the show is always the same. The body stage left. Nick, you complained. That's a rarity. Let's go back to business now, okay? <laughs> he complained. Up for you, man. You don't get fired. <laughs> you know who will be the prosecutor in court? Of course, it'll be Von Kahn. Ah, oh, shit. She isn't gonna hit me with a whip again, is she? What do you have to worry about? You only have to see her in court. She shows up at the police thing. The sounds of that whip never ends. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure Von Kahn was really interesting now, but someone else I'd really rather talk about. Oh, cool. Like Edgeworth, of course. Ah. Next to arrival. Miles Edgeworth. When the what happened after I went back home? Uh, you haven't heard what happened to him? Nick, what tell me? Well, to be honest, I'm not a to tell you either. Let's just say he's not around anymore. 
He's not around. Like, what does it mean he's not around? Exactly what he said, he's not around. Address is gone, don't say his name, okay? Why are you making it sound like he died, bro? Stop with this dramatics. Oh my god. He didn't die, bro. These motherfuckers need to stop. <laughs> Ringmaster of the circle was murdered, wasn't he? Yep, late around 10 pm. He died outside. The birds, man, in the cold are pretty sad way to go out if you ask me, Paul. I'm gonna go speed up because these birds are right. It was rather cold. I didn't see another kind of the birds are over here, right by where you saw us right now. Ah! <laughs> Uh, surprised you didn't know. I'm not laughing. Uh, actually, in Badima, I told me what happened to the victim. He was killed while by a shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So the police were caught murder as well, but well, well, uh, there's just one thing that didn't quite fit. Ah, uh, there's also something that didn't quite fit, right? Uh huh. What is it? Ah, uh, music to cover up them fucking annoying birds. Okay. What was this one thing that just didn't quite fit? The thing you mentioned earlier? Footprints, foul footprints. Footprints? Oh, there was two of them. Look at this picture of the crime scene. What's this? The wooden box under the body? No clue, forensics experts took it back and examining it right now. And? What's so mysterious about the footprints? Calm down, take a good look at the pit footprints in the picture. Well, there's two of them. The victim's footprints are on the scene, that's right. The problem is... The killer's footprints aren't there, oh. Oh, I thought there was two then. Oh no, it must be his own step, like when he stumbled forward. Oh, I see, I see. So there's no killer, bingo. Where did the killer come from and where did the killer move to? Obviously there's no way the killer committed this crime while flying. Flying culprit. Oh, we know somebody that can fly. That's when something clicked in my head. Mm -hmm. There's no way, flying is impossible, that's right. Impossible. <laughs> What's with the hollow laugh? Well, I meant nothing by it. <laughs> uh, I stayed, it means I don't want to talk about it. Maybe I can get some info about Max out Hmm. Alright. I have. I don't think I actually have a case against him. As much as I'd like to. Uh, as much as I'd like to. Uh, don't have anything. I wonder what this means. Wait, he said who do I have to talk to? He said. Uh, uh, you know what? I think. Uh, I know, I know, I know, I know. I think... Hold on. Where did the game go? Fuck me. Did the game just disappear for a second? Alright. I think I know. Okay. We need to ask about the profiles, right? This might say, where is he now anyway? I don't know. Nope, he's been arrested. He's a child of the murdered father. It's okay, I'll we'll help him. Max and the guy is he? I mean the criminal? Of course he's not. I'm worried about so many things right now. The music sounds so annoying. I hate this one. Like what? Huh? What about him? After practice was over, I went right back to his room. His room? Yeah. But all the way over there, at least the room was a room. He went off to his room in a hurry, I wonder what happened. And there she is, bro. Bro, the fact that she looks that good, but she's 18, bro, she looks like she's way older though, no? Doesn't she look like she'd be like fucking like 23 or some shit? She's fucking fine as all though, I'm not lie. What's tomorrow? What's in your mind? 
What are you, my little you? Oh, uh, well, what really? Uh, um, okay. Don't worry about me. Oh, Max Professor's love to her. And then they got some Daniel Pesson Professor love with her as well. Well, who was it? Real law. I'm trying to know who sings in the circus. Okay. Um, there's no strange power that she loved on me, bro. Hell no. Me too. No, 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 Phoenix. Okay, that's that's him saying, it, not me. As if I'd fucking want to. Cute. Hell no. Nah. Too overly fucking done. Maybe we can finally move. Oh, we can move. Look at that. Okay. So we have a uh, uh, posters, trophies. Uh. Okay, well, right in his room. Master's room, yeah, the room belonged to the victim, which means it uh, must be where Max met him last night. I see an envelope, I see already, I see the clues. No, you're not taking anything, I wanna get out of here though. Hmm? Max is hired on this piece of paper. Like, what is it? I didn't know that magician. What? That much? How much is it? it must be like 700k or some shit. A week ago. I mean, if he's flying, he probably wants to jump on shit, right? Uh, Q trophies, I guess. I mean, mini golf master. Of course, he plays mini golf. So this guy's literally in multi, yeah, multi talented. The fuck? This guy does everything. Ah. Uh, so he wanted a poster. So we're really just stealing shit. Well, let's just... Okay. Next. Nice old... Looks old and cheap. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, I thought we might examine the picture. I guess not. I guess that's his outfit. A tail coat? Uh, yeah, I could see that. It's a tail coat. Uh, let's grab a white paper that's sticking out of it. Oh, yeah, I do see that. Calm down. I just got a minute to repeat this course. <laughs> no, you're just too fucking hyperactive for no reason. God. Alright, I don't really care about all that nonsense. Okay, nonsense. What's the uh, framed up stuff saying he won this side the third? Um, more framed up stuff. Alright, and I think that is all for our, uh, our viewage. Alright, what do we have here? He's dead. That is him indeed. Uh, what reason do we have this? It's gonna be like, his outfit is really this, and not the one that's been accused of, or whatever bullshit. Uh, I don't know, I'll just check in some more. Wait, where would I have to... Oh, my leg. Uh... 
Maybe we do the profile thing with him as well. Max is the unpopular guy in the circle center. You know what I say, but her shoe follows you everywhere. Uh, uh, don't make them a criminal. Ooh. A hat. Okay. God, she's so fucking triggered. Five witness. Uh -huh. uh, who's our witness? What? That's the prosecution's room card. Uh, well, well, well. I remembered. Well, I forgot to mention that you two are barred from entering the lodging house. What? Why is that? No reason. Just something I remember to tell you. Either way, that's where the eyewitness is. Don't you dare. Don't you dare! No, we're going in regardless, bro. Oh, hello? What the fuck? Who is the clown in this room? I wonder whose room this is. The new planet also has more. More? I guess he's not here though. It's a real mess in here. Room's probably worse, so. Oh well, I give up. We'll have to come back later. Uh, who says we have to go so soon? Happened here. The fuck happened here? Oh. Are you sure the person's called Ma? Bro, I almost feel like it's actually a guy that lives here. I mean, a girl that lives here. Maybe they get this actually a girl call more or more. I don't fucking know. Oh no. Where do we go from here? Huh? Uh, look over there. What? There's someone over there. <laughs> Who the, the fuck is this guy? Hello? He sure is a quiet one. Excuse me. Huh? Me? Yeah, you work at the circus door. You know I'm just your everyday okay, person. Is someone who happens to just hang out at the circus? I don't think so. Yes, I am. I've got nothing to do with what's going on here. He's lying. Like any other person would have hung around the circus just like that. I'm an attorney. My name is Phoenix Dreyer. I'm a spirit medium, Maya. Well, I'm just happened to be passing by. I don't suppose you ha happen to be some kind of carny. No, a carny. I'm actually a performer, actually. I'm a ventriloquist. Ventriloquist? I'm Benjamin wah, 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 Woodman. <laughs> uh, your last name is Woodman. <laughs> Why are you laughing at that? Everyone calls me Ben. That's your alias, right? I believe they call it a stage name. This guy looks so fucking stupid. <laughs> yes, you. About the murder, I'll have to talk to you in detail about that. This guy's toes were too much. Head hurts, okay. Skills, I guess. Uh, I 
I, I, I don't oh. <sighs> I maybe now we go back there. How about it? Um, pick up maybe it was a trigger. Oh, looks like I was right. Hello, Kablamo. Congratulations, you're the alpha. Oh, what the fuck? No, cause your plug is yeah, I don't want that to. can excuse the bad joke or two, but this dude keeps laughing at his own joke. That's what I object to. Oh, I do not have to admit that because he isn't. Oh. Hmm. I want to get over this. girl's room. Like, bro, look at the clown outfit in pink. That looks like such a girl outfit, though, not even if it's a clown. Then again, this guy, guy, I guess, so for now, looks like they're fully dressed up in makeup and shit. Uh-huh. We don't see the true face until we see it. Say a word, okay. See if I tell us, okay. Swift word, oh, me, me. Do it. What's the matter? Just getting really okay. Do you know why? You can swear something a bit low because I'm right all the time. against me, man. That night, once I took myself to bed, I was listening to loud, now, now noise. And it sounded like a giant thump. Once I heard it, I jumped out of bed. That's when I thought, bye. So, well, so there was somebody there. That's a lie, though. How would you see somebody? How would you see somebody if there's no footprints there? That's all I saw.
Ah. Ah, kann du das noch mal? I will the card do this anymore, man. Somebody take me out. Kubo, come to the clean. Yeah, sure. Yeah, no kidding. Clean up after dinner? Yeah, but who eats like a bunch of fucking cows though? Like, bro. You can keep something still clean even after eating and not tidying up. No one has to eat like a bunch of fucking pigs though, what the fuck? Over the head here. Ah, oh, don't tell me. Alright, this is when my mouse comes into play. Okay. Uh-huh. So sick of this having a touch. Mm -hmm. A bottle. So you hit him with the bottle. Cool. Again. Yeah, stop. Yeah, sweat your fucking bullets down because I'm just gonna go straight into it. Hold on, I need to flip my blanket over. Alright. Oh, we saw this much. Do believe it'll be cold. It was on his table. You all let me say you're still quite a raise. Uh, just it was dead a week ago, you know, that's the problem. You finished your contract negotiations a week ago. Yeah. That night, the ringmaster called me to his room. Called you? Why? Private, though. Hmm. Perhaps you could share with me what you two spoke about? Well, not if I don't have to. About the violence? Isn't this why you were called into the room? Where did you get that? The cafeteria, but you already knew that, didn't you? But you already knew that. Of course. <laughs> it fell and broke on the floor. He's still hiding something else. It didn't fall and break on the floor. You hit Ben. <laughs> you hit this fucker on the head. 46? That can't be real. Lawrence curls. I thought this was a girl. What the fuck? Like, it looks the same. You think it's a guy, but I guess it's actually a guy. What about this clown? This guy don't look like he belongs here. Ben. You nailed him over the head with this ball, didn't you? Mm -hmm. And that's why you got called to the room that night. 
<laughs> she might as well be a magician. Well, as fuck, no, I'd rather not be. Ugh, man, I'd rather go back to the fucking spirit medium case. This shit is just not it for me, man. The truth is, I guess I do one drone record with her own in a fight. You could play that way. So, why'd you fight? About. Oh, that's the two lovers. Uh huh. What are you talking about the same Ben? Told that he was in love with her. Are you sure this is Ben we're talking about? All I can say is that he made me mad, and I had to, do it and I had to tap him on his hard head. That's when the ring master called me, and I realized that was my chance. Your chance? Oh, sounds good to me. <laughs> you like, I right, go for it. No one else is okay. Shut him up. What do you mean by that? Uh -huh. Oh. Oh no shit, Ventral Post. Where'd you hide though? Yeah, because it seems like there's nothing going on. Oh. oh, in his room, okay. Uh, I guess we can go get it, yeah. <laughs> Don't go hiding for bits then. We heard about your Lord of Circus, by the way. Yeah. What popular with them, yeah. Jealousy, I guess. Uh, uh huh. Thank you. Step out? So you might have something on this attention right now. Do you mind waiting here uh, for me right here? Okay. It's pretty cold outside, where's your call? It's alright, I'll be back. It should be it only take about 10 minutes, okay. And then, I'll wait for him, but he never came back. Uh, Alright, let's go get that doll then, I guess. Ah, oh, here we go. He's not here anymore. Uh, birds! I wonder if you've been making any progress. I mean, yeah, you have been. Whether they're here or not here, I don't care. Can we check the coat pocket? Fuck, man. Oh, there it is. Can we check the core pocket for God's sake? Oh, what? Hmm. 
far from them. Hmm? Take this. What the fuck? anymore I give up. I give up Madonna. Marry her, yep. We'll get our info, we can get to the trial. That's all I'm trying about. The rest is private, okay. Uh, Nick, what's going on? He's a witness for tomorrow's trial. Uh, I don't even know anymore. What happened to them? Cried Pergo. Oh, hell no. Again, there's always something happening to me. <laughs> Welcome back, that monkey. My badge. That monkey. Wow. Oh. I I I don't even care at this point. Legit, it's the last thing I care about. So smart, yeah, yeah. I look for by them too, sure. Bro, I am so over it. Like, Let's just... Let's just get out of here. Oh, okay, we do go here. Ah, gummy's off. Alright, good. Let's check... You... Unfortunately. Oh, I have no time for this. I really have no time for this. Fine, let's go. Oh, we're in this room that was on the map. Oh, I can't breathe in here. That's a wrap around investigation. All being caught, and maybe the puppet. 
Okay, well, let's get going then. Oh, for me, this was just a disaster. Just a disaster. That was so awful, man. Ugh. Yes, yeah, so I'd like to save my progress. Well, let's do the trial then, yeah? Alright. Oh. December 29, 943, level number 5. I see you. Well, hello. Well? Milk? Oh, okay. He needs a drink. Yes. Huh? We can't be having you playing in the cotton. <laughs> Where is it this time? Me! <laughs> Max, really, no one needs to play today. What's the uh, looking at rice? I like the sound of that dashing in the light of Lang <laughs> He actually likes it though. <laughs> He's like, maybe that's a good idea. Maybe I should do that. Well, here we go, courtroom number two. It's 10 a.m. Here's the start of court. Oh, her. She's there again, the Missy. What? Get on with it. Sorry, I see uh, the defendant's name is Billy Bob Jones. Well, well isn't the defendant also known as Maximilian? Yes, you do not know about that name. You know, my grandchild is a huge fan of this. Yes, call him that. Sound more friendly. <laughs> I wonder if that uh, is to our advantage. The open statement, one comma. Like, she just needs to get rid of that whole, like, the whole fancy bullshit. I mean, the puffy arm outfit shit, and she'd look good. Uh, probably didn't bother thinking you'd win this one. I mean, I beat you last time. Huh? Last spirit channeling trial with a sham I refuse to acknowledge its legitimacy. Uh, I do not count, do you hear me? <laughs> she is definitely mad. <laughs> you have no chance either. I'm not leaving this court. Okay. Uh, wait. Not in the nature of a wrong karma to lose at anything, but you lost the last trial. Yep, I guess so. I'll show you the textbook procedure for proving how absolutely guilty you are. Me? Guilty? What are you talking about? My ultimate revenge, but it's not like it'll bring her dad back. Open statement, compl- I like how they act like the people that lost in trials and shit are dead. They act like Edward died. Her fucking dad died. They act like everybody that's been, like, found wrongfully are, or have been ruined are dead. It's like, bro, nobody died, bro, chill. <sighs> well, let's wrap up this waste of time. Very well, you may call your first witness. Gobby, get up. I'll get up there now. <laughs> He's about to get fucked up here. So, to keep from welcome, make sure you need every penny you can earn, detective. Don't mention it, it's been not to go all the look forward to this. I'd like you to begin by shedding light on the events in question. I service, okay. Alright, Gobby, you may proceed. Okay, sounds about right. Yep. Green to do. Okay. All right, cross exam time.
Oh, you haven't found this motor weapon, have you? <laughs> yeah, gave us a fact, but uh, as you saw them, he's got a mod to it. Yeah, I guess. I thought the proxy was all Wedder and head off to. Wedder was playing original and Maul went to the back of to his room to try to work when the intro went to the front gate, uh, absorbed in his own ball. The master must have been off to the room, must have room to talk privately. That's suspicious. You didn't have to know what they were talking about, would you? Negotiate and salary. <laughs> well, it's not a personal power in front of the lodging house. Right. Victor really looks like it looks more like a suitcase, but uh, the victim must have been carrying the wooden box when he was killed. Carrying the box? Huh? What do you mean? It was much heavier than it looked, not to mention it was locked. Wait, that's how it really locked? What the fuck? 20 pounds? What oh, damn. I need more to answer my other lesson questions. Do you mind turning what was inside the box? Well, we found the box, it was locked tighter than for a note, so we took it back. To crack it up, and all that inside was this little ball. Huh? Careful. No, that has to be more. It has to be more than that. Uh. I mean, a fucking... A bottle, though? I feel like all we do is bomb this shit. I feel like we got the main thing, but I feel like there's nothing to really contradict here. Oh, that card, huh? Sensitive guy. Thanks for going true. No, we may step down. Call your next witness, Von Karma. Oh, the ventriloquist. Don't rip the ventriloquist, bro. This is. Don't mean me to everybody, please. Okay. Excuse me, the best call to the stand was Benjamin the ventriloquist. I don't want to be cutting off his circulation, that's it. I said that with a single. Maybe don't believe me, fine, I'll grace with the thumb. Fine, I'm doing that. Okay. Demand to know the witnesses. Uh, 
Oh, good. I left a tent with the storage. I'm going. Stop with that shit. What do I have to say? Uh, I guess she is the boss to do again for some reason. Okay, well. I left the tent with the steward in the car. What's about to order? So, so you sure? So much very much right. That's why that makes him the killer. There's no proof though. What's the best render you think? Or strand that you only saw him once? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems like you should have seen someone else as well. But oh, where are you going with this? Uh... Wait, yeah, wait, 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 wait. Now that I think about it, No, 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 Wait, no, no, no. <gasps> yeah, he should have seen him as well. Oh. There we go. Because he, if he was heading in the same way, that's the victim. That's correct. If Tro was at the entrance of Plaza, he should have seen the ringmaster as well. What? Well, obviously, I arrived at the scene of the crime before the witness. Could have seen anyone with the sense, but I forget that one out. What are you talking about? Master and Max went together to the room, Master room. Without according to the defendant, but you saw the uh. Oh,
Well, they're awfully far, can't believe you just turned outside in that weather, though. Mm hmm. The truth is. Well, maybe you were waiting for someone? Mm hmm. You can do it all without your offended theories. What? But this is witness, he's cracking the pressure already, I'm onto something. Mm hmm. Pretty spoiled the witness was waiting for out in the cold. Uh, definitely. Well, if, if he was waiting outside in the cold, it was for one person. Mm -hmm. One person only waiting for the animal tamer, Regina. <laughs> you are waiting for outside for Reg Regina to come back to the lodging house. Am I mistaken? Mm hmm. Hold up, well, maybe a bit of is right. <laughs> Alright. There is obviously a reason why this witness was there that night. He spent all that time waiting for Reginald to arrive. Moreover, even if someone else would have walked right in front of him, I doubt he would have paid them for a second ball. Hmm. What did you just say? The witness saw the defender at the scene of the crime. However, he did not see the victim on the way to his eventual demise. If you accept that, then you must accept that there is a higher likelihood that he could have missed someone. I, or I can't even say what I want to say. There is absolutely no proof that the witness was waiting for that in the favor. Uh, I guess you got me. Alright. Alright, I'll, I'll tell you. It's true, I was waiting for Regina. Pain. <laughs> Pain. Don't volunteer things. Mr. Chris, tell us the truth this time, and I mean the whole truth. Were you or were you not waiting for Regina at the lodging house? I was. I was waiting to propose to her. You are what? <laughs> to propose? <laughs> What's the matter? You think that humans have a monopoly on marriage? But the matter of a puppy marriage is not under review in this case. You're the judge. I mean, look at your horrible outfit. More pain. <laughs> Thanks, you're bumming my perfect plan is not so perfect anymore. I know you have to waste time getting to the bottom of some pretty puppet proposal. Yeah. <laughs> God, here we go again. <sighs> I swear it's every time. <laughs> I guess you're right, just because I'm old doesn't mean I couldn't propose for a two exactly. <laughs> His honor is looking a little less than honorable, you know. <laughs> Oh, what the fuck is going on? <sighs> <sighs> Alright, let's see. Okay. Well, what are we gonna give her? Mm hmm. Uh, what was it? The adamant ring. Those who really fell out of their chest. <laughs> Time for this to right here. Jork. Poor Sean, anyway. The fuck? Wait. Pain equals bad. No more. What the call? It may be something of a joke, but this is a historic moment. The first time. <laughs> I'd like to cut this argument short. I'm going to have to agree with the defense here. Would the witness please revise the testimony, yeah? Engagement ring. flaw in that hold on i just realized the flaw 
No, oh, I'm so stupid. I'm sorry. I'm retarded. I was gonna press tub. Fuck oh, me, sorry. Tub Tita. Oh. Well, the ring is in my hand instead. Do you mind if I show you something? Uh -huh, what is it? I look like they're going to double team me now. You recognize this ring? That's mine, give it back. Didn't you just certify that this video of I believe you said? In the end, I wasn't able to give it to her, so I've still got it in my pocket. Why then do I have it right here? It died! <laughs> Fucking thing just split into 12. What's going on here? There's something. I don't put me on the spot. Uh, I thought this is the monkey's room. <sighs> in the monkey's room. <laughs> no. Not that the monkey's gonna get us coming to him. Wait. Well, money really is a monkey in every sense of the word. <laughs> Money likes to go after the shiny things. Okay. I know that's a ring stolen from you. Mm hmm. This probably was that time when you got bumped over the head. Oh. Now we found why what do you just say? Any more details? Oh, well, they were stolen right after Max showed up in the palazzo. Right about when you saw the defender walk past. Well, uh, I guess you might say that. Who might have well it could have been taken around that time. God. But, uh, that's why I hate monkeys. Fuck them. It's not for you to decide what has to do with what. Now, back to the topic at hand. What do you do when the ring was taken? Well, you weren't able to catch up to him, were you? Well, you... Okay, yeah. That is indeed incredible shame. <laughs> Yeah, the floor. And that's the important point. Look at you sweating. There's a huge contradiction. Contradiction? <laughs> the witness just testified to the following effect. Up until now, the police arrived here to move from the entrance to the plaza. However, the witness just stated that he chased after a monkey. When the witness was off chasing money, there was no one watching the plaza. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? Where are you going with this little theory of yours? I'm saying that there's no possible way that this witness saw the plaza the entire time. That's where I'm going with this little theory, which leads me to the very next point. It is entirely possible that someone other than the defender was at the scene. Interesting. Objection. Well then tell me. Do you have any proof that something surpassed this vote in Trilquist? Well, he obviously didn't see the victim, the ring must arrive on the scene. However, that doesn't change the fact that you saw the defender arrive. The witness is lying. He was blinded by his rivalry with Max. Well, the defense I would does hold water. This uh, witness does have a history of animosity. Well, just for clarity's sake, let's flesh out you out exactly who you saw in that night. Ah, uh -huh. uh, uh, another one. Can we get you over and done with it? I'll give you what. I'll give you that. I was okay. That wouldn't make sense completely, right? Mm, okay. So, okay.
Are you sure you did? I thought you didn't have the doll then. Oh no, maybe I'm confusing this. Strange to you though. What do you mean? Well, if you hear Max so much, why would you bother being a uh, green him? Yeah, it strikes me strange. Why would it strike you as strange? Exactly, how is it strange to be cordial? Well, if it was simply just being cordial to a Wakala, I understand. What? Why? No reason that Chilla would ever say something nice, Max, but how do I get pulled up through evidence? The fuck? Wait, so. Huh? Wait. I'm also sure it was him. Oh. Oh no, but it can't be because he, um, bro, he was in the room because he was like, you, you were in trouble for hitting him over the head. I'm gonna use for proof. Let's try this. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, it's gonna talk about, isn't it, the whole uh, incident. Yep, a fight. Ah, that's why he wouldn't say it though. Of course not, because they had a fight. Uh huh. There he goes again, SpaceX. That morning, Ben got hit over the head with the ball, didn't he? Ben hit Max over the head, I mean. I don't fucking know, someone hit somebody, fuck man. Ain't that the mission of Salt and Battery? Uh, yeah, we'll give him a, a Salt and Battery after. This group is on the day of the crime, the defendant and witness had a huge fight. There's actually no way they would have become cordial that evening. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow, just consider the person you have the witness from the sun. There's no way a puppet this uh, luge will just up and say good evening to the rival. Are you think this witness is lying? No shit. It's obviously a fucking lie. Yes. Let's, cr let's clarify this testimony to the court. Could you explain your theory about who the witness actually saw that night? Uh, he did see someone. I think he definitely saw someone. It is my belief that the witness did indeed see someone that night. It was just someone else. That's who he had to uh, said good evening to. What kind of theory is that? The correct one. Furthermore, I don't believe the person saw Max at all. What? If he had truly met Max that night, there would have been no green at all, which means there's only one proper answer. The person who uh, the witness saw that night was not Max. The person who made the effort to greet. He saw this badge. <laughs> uh, him, right? He was the only one going out at the time of 10 p.m. Could it? I mean, it could have. Hmm, considering the ill temper of this witness, there's only one person he would greet. It must be Regina. It's Regina, right? She's so cute. No, Your Honor, it is not Regina. 
If it was Roger, I truly would have given him the engagement ring as a present. Oh yeah, I suppose you've got a point. <laughs> it was Russell Berry, the victim himself, was it not? I thought I chose wrong for a second. You are correct, it was indeed Barry. The person you saw that evening was the victim, the ring master. That's why you greeted him. Isn't that correct? Answer. <laughs> Order, how do you respond to this? Wait a second, at first I thought it was the old man, but once I got a better look at him, it was obviously okay, sure, sure, sure. A better look, I bet, sure. We've got a clear the error about the question. And there was a single person in the area of the problem that evening, and the problem is that it was identifying who. Was it him or him? The prosecution argues that it was a defendant that the witness saw that night. The witness was clear to say that he saw the defendant's three symbols. Hmm? Alright, this is getting old. Come on, man. You've got, you've got to remember them by now. <laughs> a sofa and a cloak. Anyone could wear them. They'd even look good on me. What was that? Well, the witness of the endless we repeated that you saw the three symbols, however. How do we even know it was Max, or it could have been someone else dressed up as him? Hmm, possibly even Russell Berry. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? One calmer. Do you have a clear evidence of the person the witness saw that was a defendant? Well, I. <laughs> then it's impossible for me to make a judgment at this point. Mm hmm. Oh, look, I've been. Uh, that's very unfortunate. Huh? Yes, a little too excited for your own good, Phoenix. What do you mean by that? You may establish one thing from this witness. You saw that this witness saw one person that night. Ah, uh, but who that person was can only be answered by the next witness. What? The prosecutor will provide beyond a shadow of doubt an answer to that question and evidence that clearly established one thing. There's no one other than Max that responsible for this crime. Okay, we'll see. They're gonna bring in the Oh no, this is gonna get bad. Oh here we go. This is gonna get bad. They're gonna bring in the fucking literal clown. Oh no. Oh, this is awful. This is the worst lineup of witnesses and characters in a case ever, bro. I'd not wanna do this ever again. Fuck no. <sighs> Let's see what's going on. Look, <sighs> okay. You have to believe me, I didn't go anywhere near that. Okay, yeah. We're defending you. We get it. Look, the outfit is right there at the door. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Be right back, he said. Mm -hmm. You took it off. Ah. But why would you do that? Yeah. Okay, stop, 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 stop this bullshit. Let's get back inside, please. Take us back into the courtroom. Okay, thank God. Now that everyone is back, let's get started. Proceed with the prosecutor for the, with your side, yeah. Call the next witness. Ah, here we go. Clown. A pitiful clown, why did you call him that? Take off your fit, bro. We want to see who you really are. Where's Clown? Oh my god, why'd they play the fucking Bella? Why'd they do the Bella fucking Prince of Bella bullshit? <laughs>
about a biographical gibberish. I'm just not used to being in Carmen and being caught in my life. I'm not sure what joke is best suited for this occasion. What in the world are you talking about? You're in a grand hall of justice, not some comedy club. It's easy to see your occupation. Please state your name. <laughs> Maybe this is your favorite. Mom, do uh... <laughs> well, couple plans were up. Why is it continuing the Fresh Prince of Bel Air fucking song? Oh my fuck! Why? It doesn't make sense. When did that shit come out? How old is this game? Your name? Lara's girls finally. You know what? I'm glad the whippers are getting a use for itself now. You win the start at 1015? Yeah, I did. Will you police us for what we saw? Oh, thank you, man. Well, I mean, this ain't no joke. Somebody died. <laughs> There's no joke in this. I don't care, we'll just catch up to what you- That's a long ass fucking testimony, holy shit, okay. Um, are we the ones supposed to be asking the questions here? Huh? You will listen to your call for help after the court proceedings are over. Please stick to the fact of this case. Well, I'll make sure that one of myself will be your straight man later. Mm hmm Okay. Poor gummy. <laughs> yeah, that's who it's gonna be. <laughs> Ah, oh, finally. Oh, there goes so much short of that. That's very interesting. Here. This item is so is to be believed. I have enough to pass judgment right now. Of course, there's no way this account can be criticized. The way this is a bit, how do you say, off kilter? Almost like you have some sort of atmosphere of goats around again. <laughs> Cross exam now. I feel like you push this minutes too far, it will bring disaster upon the part of this. That's a hope you are not going to get in point of save. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I hope to order Tony Joe. It's not me, I'm getting blamed for everything, man. I can't believe this shit. I cannot believe it. They're after me for some reason. <laughs> Alright. Well. So. Um, so it sounds like there might should be a penalty for. Uh... Uh... Alright, let's just see. Okay, normal so far. You're tired. Oh, okay. You just happen to glance out? What should I do? Okay, keep going. So why do you look out the window? Why? Ah, uh, they do need a reason. That's not what I meant. I meant that, well, when we spoke yesterday. Um, oh god. The witness looked out of his window upon hearing the loud sound. He did not just simply glance out of his window that night. Yeah. That's not something you just forget to mention. Let me hear what she said. I mean, it'd be best if uh, you revise the testimony. Oh, God. God, I can't believe this shit. What does the sound like? Yeah, Blizzard been having it. Mm -hmm. 
You saw you saw him getting hit? So what was he hit with? You're flaw you're flailing. What? Did you or did you not see the crime of murder committed? That's the point. Harass? A penalty? But oh, five! Five! Fuck it. We're going all in. You ain't pressing me, bitch. I've got a great reason to make my claim. I suppose you will be telling us all that great reason. Of course. The reason is the two witnesses' very own testimony. Hmm? What is the meaning of that? Mo said he heard a sound like a thumb or something getting hit. He did say that. However, Mo just stayed the following under oath. I kept watching them and all of a sudden Max bumped the window mask over the head. In more ways to believe when he says he looked out the window upon hearing a sound, there's no way that he could have seen him bumped. Yep, at night. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. What is these random dialogues, man? How do you respond to a right statement? Mm -hmm. The C team theme to anger the score. <laughs> and you're back from the jog? <laughs> it happened the way I said, pretty much. When I looked out my window, that neither of us was already faced down the snow. It's the actual crime, however, you still say you saw the criminal. Mm -hmm. I got one drop from you, I'll put you in holding cell until you learn quite a cut by it. <laughs> oh god. Assuming this is the penalty was at the scene of the crime. This should finally be good enough, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, do we really have to deal with this motherfucker? The fucking music gets fucking drummed up like crazy. It was very far away, but that shutter could only have long to max. How could you have saw him symbols? No, he has more to it. Is there evidence for this shit? I don't think we have evidence for this shit. Oh, but this shows us everything though. Hold on. Ah, uh, you're wrong. You didn't see everything. That's a lie. You say you saw all his symbols? I suppose so. Them two, right? Everyone knows that uh, he has three symbols. Three? Everyone get ready all together now. So, uh, cloak white roses. Why is everyone saying it? <laughs> Who cares if you knew that there were three or not? He saw what he saw and he saw the symbols. He forgot to mention one. Isn't that right? Do you like... Oh, why? <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> you didn't see the roses, did you? To be honest, 
If there were any roads on the first I saw. The suit crime scene was dark, it's obvious it would be too dark to see that kind of detail. But the witness said he saw uh, able to see as well, not to mention that the roads are wide, there's no way he could have missed them. The uh, road must have fallen off and the defendant saw the victim. What? If that was the case, then the police would have found them near the crime scene. But sorry, are these white roads truly material to the fact of this case? Clearly not, he was told with the court. Ah, uh, okay, here we go. I got on the ropes now. These seemingly insignificant facts have never failed to lead me to the truth yet. Truman is tried by the court, but it's not me. Your Honor, do you recall the three of testimony? There's no way I can mistake some one wearing those three ridiculous signals, yep. Trailers saw them all. Trailers saw all three of Max's symbols. However, this witness claimed there were no white roses in the person so Oh, poor. There's absolutely no doubt that this is a contradiction. Mm hmm. Mm, now, what am I supposed to think? What is supposed to be this this regard this point? This to this the point must be this. Forget the roses. Think about the testimony. The witness society saw him without doubt. Nothing else matters. Let's drop this case up now. Your Honor, may be triggered, but it does cast a doubt on the prosecution's case. Frankly, I have my doubts about this witness. It seems that unlike Ryan, the witness has not grown more mature with age. This is not sure. It's not mature. I've come to a conclusion. 99% sure that the witness saw the defendant. However, my remaining 1% of doubt is quite reasonable. If you do that for my peace of mind, I'm going to request a bit more testimony. What? If there are no contradictions in the next statement, I am prepared to issue a ruling. Oh dear. No, oh, now we really have to do it. Oh. Oh shit. Only three or whatever that was. You are one last chance. Oh. So you're telling me I have to use evidence. Oh no. Is his head? Oh, it's probably this. But... If he was wearing it, how'd it fall off? Hmm? <laughs> that makes sense. Yep, okay, that does make sense. This wouldn't happen to be a silk hat you saw that night, would it? I need the bathroom. Alright, I'm back. Yeah, that's it. The hat that he was wearing that night. No question in your mind? How I wouldn't mistake a thing like that. I see. Is there some sort of problem? Don't come. Uh, what exactly was the silk? Where was it? Where was the silk heart exactly found? Uh, must you always ask the question. It was found at the crime scene. The crime scene. That means the silk heart fell off at the crime scene. However, the witness clearly testified to the contrary. I stated that he was wearing it the entire time. Yep. <laughs> 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 He's like, oh, <laughs> yes, you're what is the meaning of all this? He's pissed as well. You are old enough to know better than to be able to get in court. <laughs> what? Let me guess, you just didn't. Oh, okay. <laughs> and nothing to tell us out, but who do you think you are? He's turning to the bright little kid. What's the matter? Yeah, he's, uh, he was, I was like, he was bound to slip something up. That's where we more for environment. More? 
What do you want? You just heard that you left up to the scene. Exactly how did the murderer leave the scene of the crime? What? Yeah. What do you mean, how did he leave the scene? You can't ask me that. Objection. Nope. I'm not budging no one, bitch. This witness is just more so full of all this one comes protest is useless. Arr. <laughs> you are pointless here with the witness of us to stay on the matter. It's alright with you, little guy. Don't talk to you like a little baby besides what guy. <laughs> okay, so good. How like, do you leave the crime scene? The answer's obvious. He just turned around and walked away. That's what I expected you'd say. You sure that's how it happened? Say what? Hmm? I'm not sure I know exactly where you're going with this. But it's now this sure do love to help on the smallest things. Ah, uh, and you sure love to fucking bitch around. Uh, yeah, the picture literally shows in no footprints. I hope I that was the right picture. Look at this picture. The problem is the footprints in the snow. Footprints? In this fall, we can clearly see the footprints of the victim. However, where are the criminal's footprints? They aren't there. So, more exactly how did the criminal skip the scene? Oh, um, he... Your Honor, this witness has already proven that his testimony is completely unreliable. I will strike all of this witness's testimony from the, account record, from the court record, I agree. This clown's testimony is as ridiculous as the clown car he came to call in. Wait just a second. You guys have to know everything I've said. I'll tell you the truth this time. You wait a second. I think you've said more than enough for today. I didn't know. I'm sick and tired of listening to you anyways. I'll give you the real deal this time, I swear. Uh, but I got the feeling things are going to get worse and better if all they get better. Long skulls, yes? Is that you provide up until now has been false? It hasn't been false, I haven't lied. It's just, it's just what? It's all the of using the bit about the criminal leaving the scene. Especially since Von Karma, her, her whip told me how to talk about what I really say. <laughs> order, I will love order. Francisco Von Karma, how could you? Why are you doing that? <laughs> if you had heard the, when the, the truth from this witness, you would have exactly s have exactly the same opinion as I have. What opinion? It's not funny. That's enough out of you. I'm going to listen to what you have to say. Now then, let's hear the truth about what you uh, uh, say you saw. He flew away. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Oh. Stop with the tea dipping. Can you stop that? Well, that was how do I put this into words? You're yeah, right. Why is she right? You believe the other witnesses. Why do you believe me? Especially since it's the best part of the story. <laughs> to be honest, this is the first time I've heard of a crime criminal. <laughs> what do you think about this witness testimony? Uh, he's, he's telling the truth. Uh, it's obvious that the witness's eyes are playing tricks on him. In the world, do you think I would mistake that joke for? Mm -hmm. Oh, now what? Oh, okay, what do you think? This being to the sky, I'd love to believe that, but I just caught up my head around that we're actually happening. You imbecile. If you disregard the need for proof, Miss Von Karma's case is sound. However, I have a feeling that this case is in dire need of more investigation. This will conclude today's proceedings at this point. It's an undisputed fact that the criminal left no footprints of the scene. Tomorrow I want us to find out the reason behind the mysteries. <laughs> I believe that's enough for today. Call it a John. Oh, thank God. Okay. And that is the end. And another day comes around for more investigation. Oh, the world's going on, that's what I want to know. 
That's how the puma flew off into the air and disappeared. Can't believe I'm asking this, but you didn't fly the night, did you? I know you didn't mean to ask me. Okay. <laughs> I can't fly whenever I want to. It's not that easy. It looks so effortless against Sid. It's not that simple. I'm not actually flying with Sid. I use invisible wires and have them poised me through the air. Why? You just told me the secret of your magic. I broke the first rule. <laughs> the only rule. The clown did it, bro. The cloud is the killer. <laughs> but uh, this is going to be the end of the trial for now. I'm gonna have to wrap things up. Don't look at me sad. I want to wrap up the fucking case right now. Here, I have no time for your sadness. <laughs> but yeah, this will be it then. All right. Well. That was interesting. A fucking clown case. For real. A fucking clown case. What is that? Oh my god, um, I don't know what to think. I really don't know. I just want to know how this ends. That's it. I just want to know how this case ends and then get on to the final fourth case of the fucking game. We'll find out soon enough. For now though, I think I'm just done with this shit, man. I don't know what the fuck I was looking at.